Hello, everybody, and welcome to Outcast Studios. I am the Drifter, as you probably know, considering how amazing and famous I am, how how important I am to the grand cosmic scheme of the universe. What the fuck is that intro? Hello, everybody, and welcome to Outcast Studios. I'm your host, The Drifter. Nice to see you. Uh, I hope you've been well and all of that, you know, the usual pleasantries. Um, this is the first time I've really sat down and done a video like this, I'm pretty sure. I was originally planning on doing something similar to this at the beginning of the, the Wilbur Soot video I did a while ago, but I ended up cutting it, and I don't remember why. But, um, yeah, hi. We've never really spoken, have we? We never really sat down and had a face-to-face, -face, or face-to-lens, if you prefer. Um, but if you've read the title, if you've seen the thumbnail, or if I haven't put it in either of those, the description, which is a weird thing to say, considering I highly doubt you'd read the description before watching the video, but... I'm rambling. That's the thing I do, I ramble. Nice to meet you, I'm Mr. Rambler. Where was I going with this? Oh yeah, right, so, the point of the video. Uh, this is like uh, an update video, or uh, my my way of getting my schedule out to you, because um, I know recently there might have been a few changes to the channel, you might not have noticed, but there have been the occasional Minecraft video or two. Um, I say, as I put out a Minecraft video every Sunday, but I just sort of want to, expl want to explain that um, to, to those of you that might be confused. Um, so, context. Basically, this channel uh, blew up because of one video I did. It was the, the Owl House Light Spell video. If you've been on my channel at all, you've probably, cons you've probably seen it, considering, you know, it's, it's the video on my channel with the most amount of views. Um, but a lot of people saw that video, subscribed, and then thought, oh, that's that's all I do, you know, I, I do Owl House, I do VFX. And while that's true, I do do Owl House and I do do VFX, a lot of people don't seem to realize that before I put that video out, I was a gaming channel. I still am, technically. I just put that on the back burner while I rode the coattails of my one success, as every Viner ever has done. Um, that was a weird reference, right? Vine. Fucking hell. Most of you weren't even born when Vine was around. That's insane to think about. Uh, but back to the point. A lot of people seem to be worried that the VFX is just going away. And that's not true. I, I want to dispel that rumor within the first however long this video is. Uh, VFX is not going away. Films, not going away. This channel is and always will remain a spot where I upload VFX content and film content but I'm also gonna continue uploading my gaming content because that's what this channel is. It's a gaming channel at heart and that's what it will always be. Not that many of you will probably care, but I've been doing this YouTube thing for seven, eight, nine at a stretch years now. And in all of that time, I've been trying to become a Minecraft channel. And I know it's an oversaturated market, all right? I've heard it all before. The point is, I was doing it back before these these Tomothy fellows and these these nightmare fellows were were, were even thinking of of doing a channel like this. That sounds really conceited, doesn't it? That wasn't the point I was trying to make. I'm I'm not trying to be like a, a gatekeeper of oh I'm better because I've been doing it longer because uh, it's 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 more complicated than that. But the point is, if you're here just for VFX, and you're not interested in my gaming content, then if you want to leave, I'm not going to hold that against you. But I'm not splitting my content up. There's still going to be VFX content. And I, I, I keep repeating that point, because a lot of people on this channel don't seem to know how to fucking read, or understand basic English. That's a bit of a jab at you, but do you really blame me? I mean, you know, no, I'm not going to get into this point here, but I have wanted to rant about that for a while. But yeah, back to the, the, the matter at hand here. Um, the schedule. 
basically I, I've, I've divvied it up in my head. I've, 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 I've planned it out as best I can to help you understand and to sort of, um... Why did I say that like there was going to be a second thing? No, this is literally just to help you understand. <laughs> <laughs> but no, um, yeah, so, to lay it out as simple as possible, Mondays, Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays are days solely dedicated to VFX and film. Saturday and Sunday, gaming content, and Tuesday, as you can tell by the day this is going out, is reserved purely for update videos, kind of like this, because I like the idea of interacting with you all. It's, it's... I get a lot of views, I get a lot of likes, and that sounds really conceited, but again, stay with me, that's not the point I'm trying to make. But I very rarely get to engage with all of you, and that's something, that's, that's one of the reasons I wanted to, to, to start being a YouTuber in the first place. I want to interact with my audience, I want to form bonds with the, the people that enjoy my content. Um, so I've reserved Tuesdays for that specific purpose. Um, another point I want to make is the reason I won't hold it against you if you like my VFX content but don't want to stick around because of the gaming content is because of how saturated the gaming content is going to become. And what I mean by that is... Okay, it needs a bit of context, as a lot of the things I say, apparently art channels, animation channels. You've probably seen one or several in your time on YouTube. The odd ones out, Jaden Animations, people like that. Those were the only two I could actually remember off the top of my head. But the reason, the reason they... What point was I trying to make again? Right, yes, so, <laughs> sorry, I'm not used to doing this. Um, I wrote a script for this, actually. Um, I was planning on putting it above my camera, kind of like an auto cue, but then I realized I'm too lazy to figure out how that works. So, I'm, I'm sort of going off the dome on this one, as, uh, as the late Kate Six would say. Um, but art channels and animation channels, I don't know if this is still true to this day. I'll be completely transparent with that, because I haven't really been in that circle since this was relevant. But a couple of years back, they were getting shafted hard by YouTube because the algorithm didn't support animation as a, con uh, as a, as a type of content. Because at the time, and I'm pretty sure this is still true, the algorithm favored short, snappy videos about 15 minutes in length that could be produced consistently over good quality videos that were perhaps longer than 15 minutes or shorter, depending on how you look at it, that came out irregularly. And like I said, that really shafted the artists and the animators of YouTube because art and animation, it takes a long fucking time to do. And because of that, they couldn't consistently put out content, which meant they got shafted by YouTube and their channels pretty much nearly died. And it's very much, I believe, in the same way today, which is why the ratio of VFX to film to gaming on my channel is so disproportionate at the minute. VFX and film, it's my passion at the end of the day. It's what I want to do going into the future, because YouTube, while it's fun, and it's a nice hobby, the chances of being able to live off of it is one in a billion. And VFX and film, it's what I've been pretty much training for for the past four years of my life. But it takes a long time to do in the same sense that art and animation does. And I'm not saying my content's as good as theirs, and I'm not saying, you know, uh, my films are blockbuster level, you know, they take five years of production to even come out to be produced. But it's the same principle. My, look at the gaps between the uploads in my Owl House videos. Those are the videos I was the most motivated 
to produce because I knew they got me the best reaction from my current fan base. But even with that motivation behind it, it still took me months to get a new one out. Not just because of how long it took to film and to actually do the VFX, but just because of how difficult it is to film nowadays. Like, you'd think with, with cameras and technology being as, as advanced as it is, you'd be able to film anywhere, but no, it's fucking bureaucratic as shit. You breathe in the wrong area of the world with a camera, they will beat you. And now that's slightly hyperbolic, but it's also not at the same time. It's, it's complicated. Just like everything in the world, it's really fucking complicated. But that's why the ratio is so saturated on my channel. The gaming outweighs the VFX simply because the gaming is a way to keep hitting that algorithm, to keep pinging it, to keep me relevant while I work on my true passions. And that's not to say that won't change in the future, because, like I said, seven, possibly nine years I've been trying to become a Minecraft channel, I'm not just going to drop that because I've found a new interest in VFX and film. I want a balance, but that balance is really hard to achieve. So, to summarize, I suppose, the gaming isn't going away, but neither is the VFX and film. The reason there's so much gaming in comparison to VFX and film is because this one takes longer. Uh, oh, and Tuesdays are for the boy- no, I'm kidding. Tuesdays are for update videos like this. It's weird, I never thought in a million years I'd actually have an audience I could talk to like this, an audience that would care about what I'm saying right now. It's, it's very surreal. I mean, when I was in your position, when I was just a consumer of content, I always pictured YouTubers to be this titanous force, I guess. They, these, these people who just constantly knew what the right thing was to do and uh, constantly enjoyed creating content and stuff like that. But now that I'm in their shoes, like, I'm just a kid sat in his living room with a camera right now. But at the same time, I'm so much more than that. I don't know. Ignore my ramblings. Those are half-baked thoughts, and if I put any more effort into them, they'll probably end up not meaning anything. Not the point. Either way, that's my schedule. That's why there's been so much gaming in relation to VFX. Yeah, I, I think that covers everything, actually. Um... Yeah, yeah, that covers everything. And if not, I'll just add a bit on the end anyway. The power of editing, woohoo! <laughs> yeah. I hope you enjoyed the video, I suppose. Um, working on a couple of big projects, some VFX, some Minecraft. In terms of VFX, I, I recently put out a poll. Uh, you guys want to see the ice tutorial before anything else. Um, then I'll do the fire, then I'll do the light, and from there, I'm not really sure. I, I'm riding the Owl House wave for as long as I can, but that's not going to last forever. So if you guys have any VFX or any film ideas that you want me to try and do, please leave them in the comments. I am hemorrhaging for ideas. Well, that's not true. Technically, I'm hemorrhaging... Hem... 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 Bed... 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 <laughs> Technically, I'm hemorrhaging... Hem... Fuck. Technically, I'm for a lack of ideas, but that's only because I haven't sat down to actually think of any in a while. I've got like three that I, I want to do right now. One of them I can't do because of COVID. The other one, um, the other one I need to do more planning for. And the third one is the one that you all know about. It's the tutorials. Sorry, I'm, I'm rambling. This is getting on. Look, <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, make sure to check out my other stuff. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe and all of that good stuff, you know, the casual YouTuber spiel. <laughs> um, we've got a Discord server, actually, if you want to check that out. I can't promise that there'll be much in there, but, you know, if you want to say hi, feel free to drop by. You know what, I'm rambling. <laughs> Just like, subscribe, Discord. Yeah, that's it, I think. <laughs> 
Sorry, I'm still new to this. Um, see you later, shitlords. Bye bye.